hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here welcome to the family if you already subscribed to my channel thank you so much for coming back to watch my videos you guys are the real mvps okay guys so today from the title below i'm going to share a story on how i was being bullied not just me but a group of friends in high school we were i don't want to use the word bully because it's too harsh but that is how i can use it for you to understand do you understand okay so um you guys are going to hear a lot of noise from the background today because there's there's a work going on in my area here so you definitely hear some noise i'm really sorry but i need to do this video i don't know when you guys will actually see the video but i'm sure you see it around february there i'm sure i'm sure for you guys so yes um let's get right into the video guys while i was editing the video i got to know that my dress had stains in the on it i'm sorry don't judge me continue watching please note i am not going to mention names and if you're watching me girl i don't have anything against you i'm just having fun i'm just sharing a story that happened in high school okay so don't take it too personal that i was like the thing has passed why are you talking about it please we still solve past questions right yeah, so please allow me to have fun on my channel if you don't understand that's your own thing okay so i'm not going to mention names okay all right so this happened in high school i believe that in high school we all have this person that lets you be so scared of i don't want to use bully because it sounds really harsh so um i we had this girl that we were so scared of see the whole girls the whole girls in my class we were in like class four we, we're really scared of this girl that she we were so scared of her and not because she she was taller than us or she was but then we were scared of her we don't know how the whole thing came up but then we were so scared of her that you guys so you guys we were so scared of her so it's our writing notes um anytime we were writing see in high school some some of the teachers when they're copying notes on the blackboard they don't care if you are done or not okay they just clean just clean the board and continue later and continue their notes so we have to wait for madame to copy her notes when she's when she's done then we continue and when we are done and the teacher is, is, is done with her notes and we couldn't cover we couldn't write the previous one we need to go for um, our, um the notes from the guys because all the girls we didn't write notes and you dare not ask her to give you her notes eh you are mad she won't even talk to you again and if you and if you do yourself bossu bossu over here and you write the notes and she's not done she'll never talk to you again and it's going to be a hell like all the girls so which we won't talk to you because our madam is not talking to you we're also not going to talk to you it was it was really you guys it was it was really bad but you know right now you just talk about it and then you laugh because when she's not talking to you they will hold, like it's only the guys that will talk to you it's sometimes the guys because some of them will not even talk to you so I think it went on and on and you know it, it it actually got to a time okay when i'm going when i'm going to school i have to give my money to this girl anytime i go to school and i won't eat so when i come back from when i come back from school my mom will ask me ah. like you know what it, when i come home i'm hungry because i need it's the whole day i give my money to her and you know i i i will I, when I come home, I just ask, I'm hungry. My mother will be like, ah, they were going to school when did you, didn't you go to, didn't you eat when you went to school? I'll be like, no, I'll give her stories and then blah, blah, blah. So there was this other girl who was part of the girls, okay? She used to bring food. So this girl used to bring food. I'll do my cover well. Okay. So this girl used to bring food to school. And the girl, the master, told this girl, never to bring food to school again so that girl left the school she never brought food to the school again yes that is how bad it was so and then one thing is that anytime it's break time she has to lead and then we follow i do understand say we are if we are if we are 10 girls and then she will lead and then we'll be following her wherever she goes that's where we have to go she's going to buy food we all sit on the same table and then we eat yeah, she's in high school. <laughs> so it's 
it's it went on and on you know we went to the library she would lead when she went she would lead us and one day um my 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 gs bestie um i will i don't mention this for you know yeah so my gs bestie came to school very early she came to school very early she was my sitting mate so she came to school very early and um she left to go to her what do we do for the section section green no you see we had um we have section blue section green so you go to your workplace and then work so she went there to work and the master told me to go and steal her calipo <laughs> you guys that was let, let's say that that was my first time stealing something so when she told me me too my madam says i should go and take something and you guys I went to take the calipo from this girl's bag and I gave it to her. When my friend came back, she was asking of her calipo. Where's my calipo? Where's my calipo? And then my so when they came, she was asking for it, and then my classroom boys were like, Priscilla stole the calipo. You guys. Yo tricked me. They said Priscilla stole the calipo. And I'm God. So she asked me, you know. And asked me, she was like, Priscilla, I never found my calipo. Now, the boys were like, It's me. I took the calipo because they saw me taking the calipo. And this girl, the master, she was sitting there. She didn't talk. She didn't even say that. Oh, maybe she didn't say anything. And they all do her calipo. So, um, but that also went by, you know, a whole lot of stuff happened, which is quite personal. So, I can't really disclose that. So, you guys, let me just jump to how we all, you know, we just. Like the thing just left her eyes, Janice. I'm not. No, I'm not saying that she actually stopped. No, no, no. But I'm trying to say that it got to a time we, you know, it all disappeared. We're not scared of it anymore. This is how it happened. So you guys, I'm a dancer. When I was inspired, I used to dance. So anytime I'm, uh, they would just choose me to be the leader. Okay. So we're doing rehearsals, and so we're doing rehearsals, and this master, she was like, no. This time around, she won't allow the person teaching us. And then the person she's teaching us was in, she was ahead of us, okay? Let's say she was in GHS and we're in class 5. So she told her that, no, she won't allow me to be the leader anymore. She's going to be the leader. And my bestie, the one I, I stole her calico, she was like, no. We were all shocked that she was able to tell her no because you can't say no to her. She was like, no. No, madam. You cannot tell her what to do. Priscilla will be the leader. And she said no, and then they were talking back, back to back, and they started fighting. And then my bestie beat this girl. So from that day, we got to know that this girl, it's only mouth that she has. <laughs> even myself, I can even beat her. So like from that day, you know, I think the following day, we all go to like, hmm. If this girl has able to beat you, then I think we all can even beat you. So that thing just stopped all of a sudden, you know. We, we were back to, you know, let's say our senses. So it, it, just, it just stopped. So yes this is this is where the story ends like i said a lot of stuff happened that i do not really want to disclose let's just take this fun aspect of it okay and yes i hope you guys enjoyed my story i'll be giving you more 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 of the stories okay i'm, I'm definitely sure that you guys will see this video somewhere february so thank you so much for watching to the end i really appreciate it a lot please don't forget to subscribe i beg you subscription doesn't take a penny so please make sure to subscribe when you're done subscribing you like you comment and then you share the video so that it will go viral thank you so much and stay safe i love you all bye